if maybe I should like live stream now or maybe I'll like move it to more like 6 p.m. Let I, maybe I'll do a poll of like what time is best or something like that. But yeah, I'm just hanging out here. It's really hot in this apartment. I thought that there was central air in this place, but there's not, sadly, which is fine. I have an in-unit one. I just had like a really bad experience with my in-unit air conditioner at my place when I lived in Sioux Falls. It actually um, had a lot of mold in it. And so I couldn't use it at all because it would like basically spread little black flakes everywhere. So like that's hella gross. Um, so yeah, that stinks, but whatever. Obviously I don't live there anymore. So now I'm here. The AC is clean and it's pretty strong too. It just unfortunately doesn't like circulate very well. So I don't know if you can hear it down here. I got one of those tiny little, it's a Honeywell fan, ones that people get for like their dorms and stuff. So it's actually what my mom said when she walked into my apartment. She was like, it reminds me of a dorm room. And like, I don't know, I find small spaces to be like very cute, very quaint, v fun. I am very excited to, I think my plan for this little corner over here is they have this thing on Amazon. It's not a beanbag chair. It's um, like memory foam or something like that. I'm pretty sure. I don't know what I, I, I think it's like a memory foam like material and then like a cloth covering and it kind of looks like just a little like lounging chair with a footrest so my plan is to get that eventually because like I do have my craft table and my like work from home chair and I can sit on the floor like that's not a huge deal to me I finished Daisy Hates the Great Undoing by Jessa Hastings that was a wild ride towards the end there and I am like mad that the date for the next Daisy Hates book isn't set. I like went on Goodreads to check it out and I was just like, where is it? Where'd it go? Like, but come on now. <laughs> so, obviously it'll come out when it comes out. So I read the first like 10 pages of Into the Dark and it's so like I can just tell like the tone shift because like something really bad happens at the end of the long way home and then you know we we don't find out all the details but we find out like ultimately what happens like right at the beginning and so it's like oh no so yeah and it's like a 700 page book. Let me grab it. It's a, th it's a thick boy. So, just hanging out. I don't know. I watched Sarah Caroli, um, her video, like, reading Into the Dark, and she cried so many times, so I'm, like, apprehensive. 